Um, hey, Russ. Um, good start here. Um, I really like the skyline, and um, I think the font's working pretty well. So um, a few suggestions. Um, I would really suggest simplifying some of the color and, and try to think about a way to unify um, um, your design. Um, these, this, this kind of square picture, you know, put in here doesn't, you know, doesn't, it, you know, really doesn't look unified with the rest of it. And, and neither do these as well. They're, they're pretty much just in a grid. So now the next part, you know, the next week, um, you really try to think of, of how to unify this. I would not, um, you know, I wouldn't put a box around this. I'm not sure what Deadly Plaza is, but, um, let me see if you included any, no, you didn't include any citations or anything that you trace, so you really could have to get that in, because then I can look and see what you're trying to do with it. Um, so you could just maybe use um, part of this or have the road. You know, you don't necessarily have to, um, you know, specify what it is if it's, you know, kind of recognizable. Um, so again, um, I'm just going to show you, I think I've showed you these before, but um, this is how this one person um, unified hers. Um, you can see that the color is very simple. Like I'm sure the Ferris wheel wasn't blue and orange and I'm sure the buildings weren't either, but that's the color is really what unifies this. Um, so as I mentioned before, just really simplify the color um, and think of how, how you want to arrange these. Um, let me show you another one I just graded. Um, this is actually one of your classmates. Um, note how they repeated the color as well in some of the forms. Some of these little windows, um, the shape, I don't know if you can see it, is repeated in this little texture. And again, the color is being repeated. So you've got the color popping and it's tying, tying things together. I would suggest using a gradient more like this other than using um, kind of this round gradient just because it doesn't, um, it could work, but it's just a little bit unclear what your goal is with it. Um, so you may have to make a lot of adjustments with the color. Each of your, um, your attractions look really good. Now you just have to really work on how to, um, how to unify it. Um, for Dallas, Texas, again, as mentioned in the video, um, Dallas should be a lot bigger and then Texas underneath it. And if you're going to have the tagline, put it up closer um, and don't center everything. Centering tends to look really static. Um, you may want to go and study some of these posters. Um, this is in the announcements and I think it's called, I put like research and inspiration. You know, I know people don't read any of this stuff, but um, again, notice how what's unifying these posters. Now, obviously, all the buildings aren't orange with this one um, blue one. But again, repetition of the white sails, repetition of the color, um, repetition of the rectangular form. Same here, color repeating. And see how this is laid out. Big, smaller, smaller, until it goes. And this is what's creating depth. Um, so, and again, um, I love that one, but that doesn't really fit into what we're doing. Um, but again, notice, again, what's working to unify this and the different elements they're using. Um, same here. Really pretty simple, right? But one, two, three, four, five attractions, but very simple. Um, same here. So again, if you're going to make the city, make it kind of, you know, bigger and then make the state really small. Um, you really don't even need that. And see, there's the tagline up at the top, the city by the bay. Um, here's another one. This is the same artist, obviously. So just study these if you need to. You can do your own searches. I mentioned all these different things to do. Um, so by studying the way these are laid out, that's really how one learns. So um, again, um, pretty good job this week. Just need to get the, the, you know, get some unity down. And I'd make the star a little smaller. I really love the skyline and I like all your attractions. You might have to lighten up this black a little bit. Um, it's a little bit, you know, it's going to be hard to place these on the back. So, <clears throat> and anyway, your font looks good too. So, um, I mean, I like, I love scripty fonts. Um, just, I don't think cities look good when it's super feminine font, like really too scripty. Um, okay. So let me know if you have any questions and, um, really nice job on these. Just, um, yeah, I know that, I know it's hard to create unity, but that's kind of what design's about and it'll be a good lesson. 
And again, I would simplify some of these colors. There's just a lot going on here. Um, okay.